hello and welcome viewers all this in is my name uh, i hope you are having a wonderful day wherever you are i'm making this short video to respond to some worries that have been sent to us especially during the weekend by zep holders who are said to be uh, under pressure from some financial institutions in south africa especially one prominent bank with the zimbabweans uh, which has been sending letters uh, and uh, messages to holders of the ZEP uh, advising them to furnish the bank with their new permits or else their accounts will be uh, cancelled. There are also others who say that they have had their accounts frozen because of the status of their permits which are said to have expired uh, on 31 December last year. So before we respond to this, I would like to ask you to subscribe to this channel, to like this video, and share it for the benefit uh, of others who may be in a, in a similar situation. So what is happening is that uh, some people, uh, about three of them, sent me letters, but there were letters uh, reminding them that their permits, as per the directive of the South African government, uh, are expiring by the 31st of December this year. So I don't think uh, there is any cause for panic around that. I don't think there is anything wrong with that. The bank uh, will always remind people they did that even last year before the expiry uh, which happened uh, on the 31st of December before a moratorium was advanced to Zimbabweans. So it is up to the banks to remind uh, their clients uh, in as far as that is concerned. But what is of worry is some people have been telling us that they have had uh, some challenges accessing some of their money with some of the institutions because uh, of the expiry uh, of their permits last year. And they are saying that some of these institutions do not want to listen to them when they say that they were given a, a moratorium. So what you need to do in that uh, kind of a situation is to download the letter that you got from Home Affairs and take it uh, to the bank, the particular bank, to your nearest branch of the bank. If you cannot uh, get that kind of service there, you then you go to the headquarters of the bank because the banking institutions, all financial institutions, were brought into confidence by the government after the extension uh, of the lifespan of the Zimbabwe exemption permit to the 31st of December 2022. So your permit is as good as uh, still valid but of course there may be some uh, challenges here and there there may be some misunderstandings here and there between you and your bank and what you need to do is just to take that letter to them and show them that you indeed uh, have this grace period up to the 31st of December this year for you to still access uh, those services from the bank and most of the banks of course have after some clients that we we, we referred uh, with the letter from home affairs have uh, reopened those accounts and they've um, apologized to those particular clients because it would have been a systemic error within the bank or somebody who may not be uh, understanding the, the status uh, of the Zimbabwean exemption, exemption permit if you still have problems after taking that letter to them then you can tell us uh, underneath this video under the comment section or you can reach out to us uh, through whatsapp or through email uh, our details are there on the channel so that we can assist you or refer you to people who are likely to assist you because your permit is as good as valid until the 31st of december this year if it's not renewed uh, but we hope that you are all going to be able to renew your permits so that you can continue accessing these services from South African uh, institutions and other uh, bodies in South Africa and other companies in South Africa. Uh, so this is what we had uh, for you at this particular time. I would like again to remind you to subscribe to this channel, to like this video and share it. If you have any problems, 
uh, pertaining to this particular issue please use the comment section underneath this video to send through your questions to send through your, uh, your, your, your your challenges that you are facing and then we'll respond to them where we don't have answers ready we will reach out to those who are in the better know and we'll come back here and update you thank you very much have a wonderful day